Monarch butterflies are one of nature's greatest creations, cute and charismatic, and also dwindling in numbers. That's why a volunteer citizen science program run through the University of Minnesota is contributing data to the Monarch Larvae Monitoring Project. It's been going for about 20 years now, and it's a project that monitors monarch populations at the immature stages. And this is where volunteer scientists come in. First, they seek out milkweed plants, which is where monarch larvae thrive. Milkweed is easy to find and easily recognizable. At this time of year, it's got um, cl little clusters of, of pink flowers. Then once a week, inspect your plot of milkweed plants for eggs or caterpillars. Walk up to each plant and you start turning over the leaves. If you find evidence of larval stage monarchs, you're asked to identify one of the five different stages called instars to the website. And again, there's help to identify each stage. There's some training videos on the MLMP website that show you how to identify a first instar and a second instar, up through a fifth instar. The entire project is a great way to get the family together for some exercise and at the same time provide valuable data. This, is a, this project is a really great way to, to track monarch populations during the reproductive stage. And then we can make comparisons um, between different regions of the country. We can make comparisons of, of uh, the number of eggs and, and caterpillars throughout one season and how it changes and when's the peak of abundance. Here's the address of the Monarch Monitoring Project. It's Monarch Lab, one word, dot org backslash MLMP. Give it a look and see if you might be interested in helping populations of one of nature's beauties. This is Tom Jensen, Outdoors.